Today, we are transforming basic pieces into stunning outfits. I know that everywhere on fashion YouTube, you get videos telling you about investing in basics, buying basic pieces, building a capsule wardrobe, and sometimes it can get a little bit boring. But I'm here to tell you that it doesn't always have to be boring. You don't always have to look like the next girlfriend, but you can actually turn your basic pieces into amazing and stunning outfit that makes you stand out welcome back to my channel my name is demi daring if this is your first time here my channel focuses on personal styling outfit inspiration and all things fashion i'm starting with the outfit that i'm wearing i know when someone sees the color the red someone might say but that's not a basic color because it has been honed into us that when you're buying pieces um, you should stick to neutral colors, which is whites, the blacks, the navies, and the beiges. But I would say, do what feels best for you. Like me, I like a bit of red. So I've incorporated the color red as a basic color in my closet. So when I'm shopping, I shop knowing that red is a base color in my closet so that's why you see me here today with a vest the vest trend is going strong and the vest is a basic piece in every wardrobe because you can style it up in different ways i'm also wearing a white pair of jeans and also it is not just a straight cut white pair of jeans it's in this balloon style because I have found that wearing balloon jeans actually suits my shape and my silhouette. But I've not left it at that. What I've done is to accessorize. And that's the way to get your outfits looking from a one to a five. What I've done is I've put this around my neck and it's actually a belt from a dress. I didn't like the belt on the dress, so I took it off. And I'm using, using it now as a neck piece. I've tied it around the neck just to accessorize my look and of course because it's summer i have a hat on my jewelry is always a staple on my hands and i have earrings if you guys can see i do like um statement earrings because i feel that if i'm wearing such a simple outfit statement jewelry can lift up the outfit and take it to where i want it to be if i'm going to use a bag I'll either go for my trusty zebra bag because it's black and white just to give it that contrast on the outfit or I might actually go for this black round bag because I just believe red, black and white, so chic, so gorgeous. I have on my feet kitten heels from H&M. They're old. I got them I think last year, sometime last year. And this is the look. We're going from a basic outfit, which is probably at the side, to this. This is the final look. Rate my look 10 over 10 in the comments and tell me what you think. This outfit is a variation of a white shirt and jeans. Most times when you come across basic outfit videos on the internet, they'll tell you always invest in a white shirt and a pair of jeans. I've taken that up a notch and this is a very white shirt. It is under the rules of a white shirt, but it's a uh, dicky. The waist of this is tight because it's too big, so ignore that part. Um, yeah, so this is a dicky and that's because I'm going to style this with something else it may not be a basic piece but i think it's a basic piece because you can actually style it up in different ways and it will actually go with so many things in your in your wardrobe even this dicky if you've watched my earlier video on wearing versus styling which i'll put up somewhere in that video you would see that it was just a normal dress but then i wanted the color on that dress i wanted to change the way the neckline of the dress looked or of the outfit looked and I wore this dicky. So a dicky you can wear under your, your jumpers, you can wear under your cardigans, especially if you don't want the bulk of a, a sleeve under there, it's a basic. So we're taking this basic piece <laughs> and we're turning it into a stunning outfit. I'm sure someone who's watched my video before would, would recognize the, this outfit, but then there was something I changed. I changed an element of it and we're gonna do that. I'm also going to change my, my earrings because this is what I was wearing before. So I've added in my third piece 
and that is this two sleeveless from zara and it's giving it a twist it's no longer just a basic outfit it has taken it up a notch i've changed out my earrings i don't know if you guys can see this is never this is never ever flattering this angle but please just bear with me and then i'm going to change the shoes into this it's so hot but i've had to close my windows because they're mowing the grass outside mowing the lawn so yeah so this is it um on my face you guys know that this girl will always always go for sunglasses so let's get that in there i have my blue sunglasses just tie up the look you guys know that i will always do that don't mind the hair the hair is having a moment <laughs> and of course i have with me my dkny bag we've gone for a basic white tee a basic white shirt and jeans to this so this is the third outfit i had to open the windows it's too hot Okay, so just in case you hear like sounds, I'm so sorry. It's so hot and I'm sweating and I don't want the makeup to, I got all glammed up for you guys. Okay, cool. So back to what I was saying. What was I saying? Okay, third outfit. <laughs> T-shirt and jeans. I know someone is sick will say, oh, this is a look. It, you slayed. You don't need to do much. It's casual. You can wear it out. It's good. But you know, I always say, let's take it up a notch. Going to switch this out and try to make it into a stunning outfit. An outfit, an outfit that, you know, you'll be like, okay, cool. Okay, I could try this. Yeah? Give me a minute and let's do this. Okay, let me see if I can do one of the Instagram transitions. Let's see. Okay, I hope I got the transition right. So what I've done is I've switched out the jean for this tool dress underneath. You guys will see a pattern here. Like, oh, you like tool? I do like tool and share. You know, there's always something really nice and sexy about it. So I'm going to style this up because you guys are going to say, ah, how is this better than what you were wearing before? But I'm going to style it up. I have on this um, corset belt that I got from Original Mango. Um, she no longer does this anymore don't think she's still in business it's been a while so i'm just going to use that around my waist to give me some definition and let's do this so the cassette is on i think i'm going to roll up the sleeves just because i don't like where it falls it's actually my husband's t-shirt just go for this one's by vince camuto i'm so hot <laughs> hot and humid that's what london is that is done a bag for me i'm gonna go with this tiny bag i got from steve madden on tk mac i added in the pearls those are my necklace i just added it in to add give it like some extra zhuzhing and then i'm going to wear sunglasses i've gone for these red ones because it's an all it's a black and white very basic outfit so i'm going for this just to give you a pop of color and this is me so we've gone from the t-shirt and jeans to this i could have won a chunky necklace but i think it's fine because of the corset let's just make it bunch let me show the back hope i'm not flashing <laughs> I don't think I am. I think I'm quite decent. <laughs> I don't think I'm giving my husband this, this shirt back. Okay, for my next outfit, I have this white shirt and black trousers. And even the white shirt, if you want to even say, I don't think it's like a basic white shirt, but it's an oversized white shirt, which has been constructed in a way um, to give you um, structured shoulders. So that's how it's been constructed to look like you have shoulder pads in there so this is also a nice silhouette because i like i said earlier i said that if you're going for your basics always go for um colors cuts silhouettes that suit you and that's why i go for this one i went for this one but this is not the outfit this is not the outfit we're wearing today because first of all it's summer it's hot even wearing this to show you um, I'm dying inside. So let me change this. I got this white shirt, oversized white tool shirt. I know, right? Share. You guys, I have a thing in my wardrobe <laughs> with, the, with the closet, with the items in my closet. So I, I got this white shirt from Zara. It's oversized, opaque in the, in the front, but then share at the back. And I thought it was a nice um, spin on just wearing a plain white shirt it's quite oversized so let me just button it up my mic is on I'm going to rush up 
the sleeves sorry i'm looking at my mirror just to style it up a little bit quite oversized but then it has this tiny belt at the back that you can actually play around with how tight or how loose you want it and um, for my shoes i'll go for the white ones i showed you guys earlier I'm looking for nice strappy black ones this are linen pants from h m and then for my bag i always go for a pop of color i'll just go with the red bag um yeah i'll definitely do sunglasses because right now my makeup is melting from all this heat so give me a minute they're not too dark so you can actually wear them inside and that's that's my look stunning chic outfits oh earrings stunning set I don't know if you guys can. I don't like coming close because it's so unflattering um the stunning set vintage set <laughs> I copped from my mother's jewelry box oh she gave it to me I didn't cop this time she gave it to me I wasn't going to wear any um neck piece but then I was like you know what I might as well because we, it's a stunning outfit video so I might as well just do that and then you just get the slither a peach of the neck piece and that's it it's chic it's classy it's just it's up my street up my street what do you guys think let me know so the final outfit is this this is not a basic but i would say uh mini black dress is a basic but when you buy it in a silhouette or shape or structure that you love and you like you're sure to wear it all the time now even when this balloon or bubble trend is over i would still wear this because i do love it i love the fact that when i wear it, i feel so free it's it's a large tent like fabric but then i don't look too big in it hopefully hopefully it doesn't come across like i look too big in it then it's got this nice detailing at the bottom i would always wear this even when it is out of trend so this is where i'm going to with this dress yeah and then i style it up as i will it's summertime i'll probably wear a hat i've worn my hat i'll wear my earrings my sun earrings And my earrings i'll wear a choker yes some people might say oh that's too much but for demi not at all and that's me that's all i'll do just one single gold choker got to my earrings i have my hat on and what will i wear on my feet i could wear either my emmys black sandal or zara ones this brown zara ones i think i'll go with the brown zara ones and for my bag i'll go for my tan parisa wang bag which i got for my birthday and yeah this is me okay so we've come to the end of the video i hope you enjoyed it i hope you've got an inspiration um if you've not hit the subscribe button please do hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell until next time oh and if you want to follow me on social media i'm at demi daring on all social media platforms and i'll see you next time bye